The Operators Challenge is very important for a few reasons. One, it gives recognition to the men for the hard work that they do on a constant basis. Not a lot of people see and not a lot of people understand that when you flush, there's a lot of steps that go before it goes out into the receiving waters. And second of all, that recognition lends itself to morale building. In today's Operators Challenge, we have three different events. Starting off with the safety event, it's simulating a rescue of somebody that got trapped, fell ill, passed out, down a manhole. It'll simulate a true rescue that could actually take place in any one of our locations. The pipe event, which is collections event, simulates a broken pipe that has to be tapped and replaced that would be in the ground. The pump event is, it's actually called the maintenance event. It's gonna be the breakdown setup of a Godwin pump the men are going to have to prep the pump, they're going to have to get it ready, and they're going to have to put it in operation. All the events, again, are timed. There are penalties for uh, missteps that they may take. So we have stopwatches and we have scorecards. The other aspect of the competition, which is not as well publicized as what's going on today, is the lab and the process. The lab is where they go through and they do uh, the chemical and biological aspect using the beakers and the test tubes and then you have the process exam which is a written exam it's just like any other college course that you would take in wastewater the ones that win move on from city competition to a state competition then the winners from there which we've had two state champions from North River wastewater treatment plant they go on to the nationals and again, this is a big morale builder. It really does raise it in the plant, and it raises it in the other plants, because the guys all go back and talk about it. And it's important. It shows off their skills.